The blind snap trap is an open architecture trap that's designed to have a high interaction rate with all types of predators. So this is our early prototype deployed at our field test site. The early test results are very promising. Uh, pretty much every time we set this trap at the moment, we catch something. We think it's going to be useful in a couple of scenarios. First of all, in a high population area where there's a lot of predators around, uh, it's going to have a much higher catch rate than existing traps. And secondly, when we're down to those last few hard-to-catch predators, it's going to be very useful for those. Our initial testing here is telling us that the, this trap is going to give us 20 to 30 times more interactions than traditional traps. The open architecture of this trap means that we can catch all predators with it. And we can see in here that we're catching possums, we're catching uh, cats, we're catching hedgehogs, we're catching rats. So that's really promising. So these are our lightweight hazing fences. They guide the animals towards the entrances in the trap. This is the capture area of the trap. Uh, it has open entrances on three sides. The animals walk in, there's no barrier to them entering. But once the animal has walked into the trap, it'll trigger a sensor in the centre here and the blinds will fly up. Once the animal is trapped in the front cage, its only option is to come into the holding cage at the back through this trap door at the back here. It'll pass uh, under a sensor on the back cage and this trap door will close behind it. The funding from Predator Free 2050 Limited is going to allow us to take this prototype to manufacturing at scale by the middle of 2021. Currently this is a live capture trap with sensors in the front and the back cage. Uh, we are going to add an auto reset mechanism onto this early next year. We are then also going to be able to identify the predators using our thermal cameras and the AI technology that sits behind that and then add an auto kill mechanism as well which means we can capture multiple animals a night. Traditional traps are really only useful in a suppression scenario um, and we're very aware that it can cost a lot of money to catch those last few hard to catch predators. So we think this trap can make a real difference to eradication.